When you have a new Thunderbolt device, when you plug it into the Thunderbolt port, this one I've got is a docking port. When you plug it in, hopefully you'll see a little, it will prop up, up the actual wizard itself. Now, you can't, and it says, and this one is do not connect. What you want to change, there's also connect only once, but you want to always connect. So you, this is the user authoritative connect, always click on OK. And you'll see now, set up, you can right click and go approve, manage devices. Approve devices, you'll see it's all both attached and it is clicked on and now I can actually use the dock. Uh, the actual Thunderbolt port itself. You will also right click on the Thunderbolt. So this software is called the Thunderbolt software and it looks like a lightning with a blue icon on it. And you can see the view attached devices on there. This usually explains why some times when you actually plug a Thunderbolt port on a laptop itself that has Thunderbolt chip and it doesn't actually display to external monitors, keyboard and mouse not working, things like that, is because the Thunderbolt device, which is the docking port, hasn't been approved by the software itself. Normally, to make things easier for my end clients or users, I would normally disable Thunderbolt security so any Thunderbolt device can be plugged in so you won't get problems with having to approve every Thunderbolt device itself. So to do this you've got to do it in BIOS itself. So this one here is a Dell Latitude BIOS itself. So and usually this is found under system configuration. You have to find in your different notebook. Um, BIOS itself, but this one is a Dell, so it's under. There will be a, usually a heading called uh, IT, usually it will be under devices or something in that sort of proximity, and they would normally be a Thunderbolt um, configuration. This one's called the Thunderbolt adapter configuration. And if you can have a look on down here, um, sometimes I've seen on Lenovo's and HP's their pull down box for this, but for this one here, you, you'll see this one has a checkbox for um, at the moment set to level security is set to user authorization itself. Um, I normally would turn this onto security level to no security itself, so that allows any sort of Thunderbolt device plugged into the notebook and it just works. Um, you can set this one to also just to have display only.